this point in the season with where they are in the standings? Yeah, it's exciting. Um, have a chance to compete for another cup and uh, know a few guys here, so it's uh, been a good morning. And obviously, we've heard you get your family lives here. Just what does it mean for yourself personally to not only be here with the Panthers, but to be in South Florida? Yeah, it's nice to be together with the family again. Uh, we're very excited. Uh, my kids and wife are excited. And uh, yeah, it means a lot, obviously, especially when you play hockey and spend a lot of times away from home. So I'm happy. And obviously, a lot of things can change. Right? We saw you out there this morning with Barkov and Reinhardt. Just the excitement and the potential to play with two guys that you know like that this year. Yeah, I mean, whatever is with this team is exciting right now. And uh, uh, I talked with them a little bit this morning. They're very smart players, and uh, I'm looking forward to play with them tonight. From watching from a distance and playing against them a couple of times, just from an outsider's point of view, what stands out about, about this team? I feel like this team played with emotion, and uh, it's a hard-working team who have a lot of skill, and uh, it's usually the hard games to play against. And I'm very excited to join this side now, and uh, we'll do everything to help the team. Why did you want to come here? It was reported that this was a spot that you were interested in? Yeah, it's a, I feel like uh, this chance have a chance to win a Stanley Cup and my family was here too. We look at the options and we decided this will be the best possibility for us. Aaron Eckblad just said you, know, you skate here in the summer with the guys. Uh, do you feel like you kind of know them a little bit, uh, not only playing against them so many times, but just working out here in the off season? Yeah, I knew some guys from the summers. I knew some guys from way long ago, like Bob and Nico Mikola. And, uh, they was always joking to me to come join them, so it <laughs> finally happened. And uh, yeah, even in the summer when we skated here, it seems like a gr good group of guys. And uh, I'm excited to be part of it. So yeah, skating around with Nico, how much did you, did you talk to him before things or anything like that? He's only been here a year, but you guys have obviously been together a while. Yeah, I talked to him after games, and yeah, he just shared his thoughts in the group, how good the group is, and uh, how much he enjoys his time here. And uh, like we played together in St. Louis for like four years, so uh, I'm, I was happy to see him again this morning. And there's, you know, <clears throat> sorry, reports your family lives in Fort Lauderdale. Is it Miami, Fort Lauderdale, uh, somewhere around here? I'm in mean Weston. 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 So it's nice and calm. <laughs> <laughs> You're not one of the uh, guys hanging out in the uh, intercoastal, right? Oh, I like my house. <laughs> I stay there. So every morning skate, you're going to be smile to smile ear to ear every day? Because it seemed like you guys were extra, extra happy. Guys who knows me before, they know I'm, most of the times I smile. <laughs> <laughs> if I don't smile, they just ask what's going on, <laughs> probably. So. How did yesterday unfold for you from finding out the news and then flying here to Fort Lauderdale? I've been a long flight from Anaheim, but uh, just woke up from a phone call that uh, I got traded. I had a chance to say bye to the guys. Um, Ottawa had a very good group of guys too, and uh, I enjoyed there with them. And uh, just hop on a plane, come here, meet my family, spend night at home, and come here. Was that at the team hotel in Anaheim? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, buddy. I have to ask because it's kind of an inside job. What are you going to miss most about Ottawa? I'm not thinking about it right now, but probably if I have to answer, probably the people around. I have a chance to meet a lot of great people who helped me a lot. Uh, not only on the hockey part, so, you know, have n make new friends and uh, now focused on my time here. What, what did you learn in winning a Stanley Cup? What, what, what did you learn that maybe you could help, maybe help people here? Or just it's your probably takes some time to take experience in the playoffs, which uh, I feel like the team have last year. And uh, usually when you go this deep, you know what it takes. And... Uh, I think there is no other plan where not everybody just need to work hard, but everybody important. Everybody do their part of job, and uh, you know feel feel happy for for the other guy. Uh, like we've been in the playoffs a lot with St. Louis, and like after, before we won the cup, we had some experience in 2016 when we went to conference finals too. So we already knew like how hard it is uh, every next round to play. You, were you willing to? go anywhere else, or was was this the only place you were <coughs> thinking about? Oh, I think this was the only place I think about. Last season, you've been through this before, getting traded before the deadline, going to contender. Going through that experience last year, do you think that's going to help a little bit more with readjustment going to the last 20 games of the playoffs here? Well, what do you mean? Like, 
you, you spent your full career in St. Louis before getting traded before the deadline to New York. You're doing that again this year. Having that experience last year, do you think that's going to help a little bit just readjusting to a new team? Uh, I'm kind of a guy who get used to people, you know. I don't really <laughs> like to meet, you know, 15 new guys, but uh, probably last year experience will help with that to feel more comfortable around. But uh, it's been very good so far. Everybody is very friendly and helpful. and. Uh, I think the biggest part is my family already here, so it's making it way easier. How long, how long have you lived here and went your family? Just this year. Oh, yeah, we have a place here we usually spend the summers in, but uh, this year we decided they'll stay here and kids play hockey, <coughs> study in school, get some sun. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thanks, everyone. Thank you, guys. Have Thank a good day. Welcome. Welcome to South Florida.